Welcome to Military News YouTube channel. Leaving behind the 10th day of first fighting in Ukraine, Ukrainian defense complexes and ground troops are putting on a big show against the Russian Air Force. Ukrainian troops shoot down and destroy an average of eight Russian warplanes per day, with both the US-made Stinger and the UK-made Enlor. Anti-aircraft systems Ukrainian air defense has already destroyed 39 Russian aircrafts and 40 helicopters. The Air Force Command of Armed Forces of Ukraine posted on Facebook that since the start of the war Ukrainian air defense units destroyed at least 39 Russian aircrafts and 40 helicopters. On March 4 alone the Russian invaders lost three Su-25 aircrafts, two of them in the Chanyiv region one in another region. Also according to the command on March 4 three more helicopters belonging to the Russian troops made their final flight. Thus, during the nine days of the war Ukrainian defense units destroyed at least 39 Russian aircats and 40 helicopters the statement said as noted the full-scale invasion of Ukraine the aviation group of the Russian army gathered near the borders of Ukraine had 700 aircraft units, 450 aircrafts and 250 helicopters. According to the Ukrainian Ministry of Defense since the beginning of the invasion of Ukraine Russian troops have lost more than 9100 people. The Ministry of Defense notes that the danger is clear the calculations are complicated due to the high density of hostilities as reported on February 24 Russian President Vladimir Putin declared war on Ukraine and launched a large-scale invasion. Russian troops are killing civilians bombing and destroying important infrastructure facilities and missiles are hitting Ukrainian homes. Martial law was declared in Ukraine and general mobilization was declared. The armed forces of Ukraine with the support of the whole nation bravely resists Russian aggression. Ukraine filed a lawsuit against the Russian Federation at the UN International Court of Justice in The Hague. International Criminal Court prosecutor Karim Khan launched an investigation into the situation in Ukraine.